Keroche Breweries employs thousands of employees, directly and indirectly, whose livelihoods have been negatively affected by these arbitrary closures. We now have families not able to raise uh, basic amenities, landlords locking out workers, school children staying home, and have now been made beggars in a country where unemployment is already a very big issue. These draconian KRA measures are only targeted at local investors while safely cushioning international investors. It is totally against the famous Buy Kenya, Build Kenya mantle. The COVID-19 pandemic was not only a Kenyan issue, it was a global issue. And this farm, which is originally Kenyan grown for the last 25 years, agreed that yes, we agree we have tax arrears, we are willing to enter into an arrangement, and they actually wrote it down. So many banks that are post-COVID-19, I am looking back here, many have gone home for these workers. People who are being locked out of their houses, children that are not able to pay fees. This is a Kenyan grown uh, factory, Kenyan grown industry. If anyone is serious in terms of growing Kenyan farms, in terms of giving incentives, we, are, we should be able to cushion any Kenyan brand that has grown all the way for 25 years, that are defended jobs, and we'll be able to actually guarantee meaningful employment for these people that you see behind us.